Hello. Hi everyone. Today's the day. <laughs> it is. We are about to embark on the most exciting trip ever. We are flying to New Zealand today. Via Dubai. Yes, we're going via Dubai. So we are about to take you on the biggest travel day ever. 23 and a bit hours of flying. Three hour stopover in Dubai with a 16 hour second stint, which is the longest trip I've ever done. We're also flying Emirates business class for the first time ever. It's going to be a completely new experience. Yeah, that, we I'm are so excited that. about that. Yeah, it's going to be amazing. We thought we'd take you along and show you every detail. This is a very special trip because we are going to get married on a half world cruise where we're sailing for 60 days on board we're spending six days in Auckland beforehand and we're celebrating my 30th birthday on board we're also on our honeymoon so it's a very special exciting trip it's like three or four trips all combined combined <laughs> it's two years in the making that we've been planning this we've planned it for a long time yeah and I can't believe in less than an hour we're actually going but if you're new around here hi I'm Brogan I'm Benji and if you haven't watched our videos before we make home travel and lifestyle vlogs with basically in the UK. We've also made a few videos talking about this trip already so I'll leave those linked below but to give you a summary of where we're going and what we're doing we are flying to New Zealand then we're going to Australia spending some time in Sydney, Brisbane, Cairns then we're going to Indonesia and doing Batong. we've got the Philippines and doing Manila then we've got Hong Kong where we're doing Disneyland for two days Vietnam, Singapore, Malaysia, Mauritius, South Africa for Durban and Cape Town and then finishing in Tenerife before we arrive back in the UK. The most exciting trip ever. 17 countries. It's completely new to us as well. We haven't really done any, many multi-country. No. Multi, Multi-continent. Yeah. Multi everything. And traveling in such a luxury, incredible way. We love cruising so much. We're gonna be going on Piano Cruises Arcadia, which we'll talk to you more about in the next few vlogs. But for now, let's take you on a travel day where we're gonna be driving two hours to Heathrow. And as part of our business class, Emirates package, they also give you a car. So they're picking us up and taking us to the airport, which is a whole new experience. And they take us to the hotel, the other side as well, which yeah. is really cool. It's so are we gonna have someone with a little name tag in Auckland? No way. We are, yeah. That's so cool. It's got your name I've never been that person before. <laughs> This is my travel day outfit. I've got a sweaty Betty tracksuit. I normally travel in leggings and a jumper, but I wanted to be comfy because this is a long journey. But I am gonna get changed when we get to Dubai. And then I've switched, I did have a bag, tote bag, but I've switched to a rucksack that I wanted to pack anyway. And I've got my bum bag. I've also got my wedding dress. And then here are all our cases, which looks absolutely wild. If you wanna see our packing vlogs, I've got a three part series you can go and see. We have two cabin size and then two medium, two large. So it's small, medium and large each, if that makes sense. We're on the way. On the way, with the car. Benji's reading a book. I didn't have time to finish it before we left. I only had like 80 pages left. I've taken pictures of it. Look at my wedding dress just chilling on the back seat. Alrighty, we've just arrived. Look at Benji with the luggage and the bags. <laughs> I've got the hand luggage. We haven't flown Emirates for a while. I'm very excited. We're at T3 at Heathrow. Yay! We're ready. Oh my goodness, I can't believe we're taking this all across the world. <laughs> this is insane. Are you ready to go and check in and do the business class lounge? Let's go. We are all checked in, all four cases have gone, and now we've just got our hand luggage. We're ready to go through security, we have fast track. I love airports and I love flying, so to me this is such an exciting day. <laughs> Okay, we just went through security and that, that was, was so seamless. a breeze. Honestly, we didn't have to take anything out of our bags, they no. scan everything. The new scanners, so you don't have to take liquids out, laptops, Nothing. anything. So good. And with us with all of our tech stuff, it was just, we were in, It in used to take us ages. Five. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. So we're now making our way to the lounge for the first time. Yeah. Let's go, I'm holding my dress like this. <laughs> I can't believe it, I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna cry, I'm so overwhelmed. Wow, this is it. Let's go on in. Oh my goodness. In we go. Oh my gosh. Ah, we're going to the Emirates Business Lounge for the first time ever. I hope they got all the snacks. I don't even know what it looks like. Oh wow, you just walk straight in. It's so quiet. Nice. This is beautiful. 
Okay, so we're obviously here. We've got this little corner space. Ben just already picked us up a couple of drinks. We need to investigate ordering food and they've got showers right here. I'm so excited. <gasps> oh, thank you. So they've got like just eight bottles of and open oh my gosh, we'll have to like show. No. Cheers, babe. Cheers. So down this end, you just help yourself to the champagne like Benji just did. Wow. <laughs> There's also lovely bottles of water and beers. Wow. Look how fancy it looks. And then down this end, they've got a coffee machine and then soft drinks and loads of different teas and alcohol. So luxury and bougie, I can't even cope. I had to ask someone because I didn't know where I was going. They said that there's a buffet down the other end, so let's go and take a look. Look at the Rolex clocks on the wall. <laughs> I don't know if you can appreciate how lovely this is. It's incredible. Oh, here we go. This is what we're talking about. This is insane. Look at that. I don't want to eat too much because I want to eat my meal on the plane, but it looks insanely good. They've got beef with peppercorn sauce. Look how nice this potato is though. <gasps> Chicken and leek pie. Sorry. There's more down here. They've got fish and rice. Oh my gosh, I want a bit of chocolate cake. <laughs> wow. Okay, I wasn't sure if I wanted to have any food because I know we're going to eat on the plane, but I just had to try it. I saw Benji get some and he got the chicken and leek pie and the potatoes and I thought, yeah. Chicken milanese. Oh. Nucky. Got some gnocchi as well. Is it good? Yeah. Let's try these potatoes. The potato is amazing. Mm. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. <laughs> this feels so surreal, Benj. I feel yeah. like we shouldn't be in here, yeah, do you know what I mean? Come and tell us to move. You've got to go, guys. Good, yeah. good, so good try. <laughs> oh, that pie is heavenly. Oh, it's really tasty, it's got a nice crust. Mm. I thought we'd try some of the desserts as well. So we've got a passion fruit panna cotta. And then this didn't have a label, but I thought it looked quite nice. So I'll give that a go. You're gonna love that. That is to die for. Have you got cheese and biscuits? <laughs> so we finished in the lounge and it was lovely. And the gate is right here. So we'd have to walk to a gate, which blows my mind because I got the notification through on my phone that said your gate five so we walked up there and he was like not yet <laughs> you'll get called so they've just called first class so we're just waiting for us next I'm a little bit overwhelmed at the fact that we're gonna have beds and like big seats and like a little area to put my things <laughs> I've never turned left before, let alone going upstairs. We're in. Wait, how does this, how does this close? That's what I need to learn straight close. away. So we're in the middle, seats 9E and F. Yeah, they call it a couple's booth. Yeah. They call it something like that. This is an A380, 880 or something? A380, or just an A380? A380. Hi MTV Cribs, welcome to our pod. <laughs> Have you already put the sport on? Right, so this is my seat, and in front of us we've got loads of legroom. Oh my goodness. This is the little sort of booth area. So there are drinks already stocked, loads of plugs, a little iPad going on here, slippers and an eye mask. That is really soft. And then here are some headphones, big over-the-air ones. We've got a pillow and a blanket. Hello. How's it going? Yay, we can see each other now. Do you, um, do you fly here often? <laughs> I have just been given a little makeup wash bag. Ooh. Wow. There's a deodorant, a dental kit. Look at that Bulgari then. Huge. Wow. There's a little mirror, tissues, a little brush. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I love it. Oh, look at this. Wow, it's well nice. Oh, wow. It's a proper Bulgari bag. We were just waiting for the captain to finish the announcement so we could hear it and they dimmed the lights. But inside Benji's, he's got a proper razor. And then so so like the little slippers on. Is that the ones you got in this little bag? Oh wow. 
I want some. I've got you a different eye mask. <laughs> This is so specific, but I normally struggle to get my compression socks on in economy because there's obviously no room, whereas I had no issues. There are six emergency exits on the upper deck. If needed, lights at floor level will direct you to the nearest exit. Wow, look at the plane. That's crazy. We just got hot towels. <laughs> Hi, thank you so much. It's brand new. Like sometimes you get menus that have been used yeah. like ten times. Oh, they've got mock towels. There's so many lovely things, but I'm gonna have the chicken and Benji's having the duck sandwich. There's some desserts as well. They have sandwiches on other snacks. So on the Emirates, you can actually see all the movies that are on the plane in advance on the app. And I went through and I favorited loads. When we're in the air, I can connect to Wi-Fi and sync the playlist to my seat so I don't have to scroll through everything. But just to give you an idea anyway, let's have a look at the latest movies. I haven't heard of this, that sounds quite good. We saw that in the cinema, it's a really good film. I have picked my first movie. I really wanted to see this at the cinema and didn't get a chance, so fear to camp it is. Look at the little lights on the ceiling. They're like stars. I've been watching the fear to camp for like 10 minutes and it's not my vibe, so I'm gonna move on. So he's got his table, we've got a mattress. <laughs> And we've also reclined our seats a bit now, which is better for me because I was not quite reaching it, but now that's a lot more comfortable. We also have like three pin plugs. So in a bit, I can put football manager down here and get my laptop out. I'm watching My Life with the Walter Boys on Netflix. This is a first for me, an espresso martini. Like I'm dining in some sort of restaurant. <laughs> Here's my dinner. I've got the chicken and mash, and they gave me a choice of bread. So I've got some garlic bread. I've got a little salad on the side. I've got a Pepsi, water, and even look at this cutlery. It's like proper heavy, nice cutlery. And Benji's got a duck Comfy barbecue duck sandwich. sandwich. Oh yeah, look at that. This was so yummy. I think he's enjoyed his. All good. They've given me a little chocolate dessert and a little box which I'm assuming has some little chocolates in too. I'm just using the bathroom obviously and I thought I'd show you that it is very nice. It's very clean and modern and lovely. I've got little flowers there. They've got like the little lounge area outside so I'll try and show you but most of the passengers are asleep in their lie down beds. So I think I'm gonna try and do that next, but I don't wanna sleep. We're gonna really try, we've got a plan. And so we wanna try and stay awake as long as possible on this flight so we can sleep the majority of the time on the next flight. Just realized that they have a little drawer. You can brush your teeth if you didn't bring one down. I might actually do that, you know. Now I'm here and it's night time and I've just eaten my dinner. Let's do that. Ooh, oh, it's a proper Colgate toothbrush. Fancy. Oh, and a big toothpaste. Okay. Oh yeah. That's really nice. <laughs> okay, let's go. This is the bar. Look how nice it is. Wow. Look at these nice lounge area. Oh my goodness. Wow, right. We are heading back. Some 
fruit and some pastries and an orange juice and a bit of yogurt which I thought would be perfect so I'm probably just gonna have this not really feeling like any of this right now I have to say that first flight has gone pretty fast hasn't it I've got it really true plan of action is we need to go get the dress and the suit in the wardrobe we need to gather all our things we'll find the lounge i don't know if we i assume we go back through some sort of security and unfortunately all the other stands are occupied so we have to be patient a little bit more thank you we got a problem in the last stand which happens it's eating into our layover time Ooh. So we, we have plans i want to shower i want to shower i want to see what the food's like welcome to dubai well, the last one's off the plane because we were waiting to get in the wardrobe. <laughs> Thank you, bye! <laughs> Can you take that? <laughs> they were the nicest crew, so lovely. We were waiting to get off last. We actually sat on the runway for 45 minutes in the end. So we've eaten into our layover quite a bit. And then we were last getting off because we thought our outfits, <laughs> the wedding dress and suit, were still in the wardrobe. But the crew had moved them to the front for us, which was very lovely service, so. Yeah, we've got them. Okay, so it's very easy to tell because it literally says connections in red. There we go, nice and easy. I don't know what time it is. I think it must be like quarter past, maybe half eight. And we board at quarter past nine. So it's whizzing round. So we arrived at this business class lounge and we're apparently in the completely wrong place. So we're not doing very well at the moment. We've got to take a train apparently. Okay, I think we are going to B gate. This makes a lot more sense. Onto the train we go. We're learning. Oh, you all right? Yeah. We are now in this area, trying to figure out where the Emirates Lounge is. Oh, this is where the water is. Oh, cool. We've got to get the elevator up now. We're getting there, we're getting there. So long for our three hour layover we, we were looking forward to. Shower. It's like three minutes now. <laughs> more escalators. <laughs> we don't even know this whole airport if I got my hands. Yeah, right. And it is. 8.40. Oh, this is what we want. I don't know if you can see. This is not a glow. This is sweat. <laughs> I feel really happy and like how epic, but also wowie. That was quite a mission. But we're here. We're in the lounge. Benji's run straight to the showers. We both obviously are desperate to have a shower. To be honest, neither of us knew you could even have showers until you guys told us. So we've been looking forward to this for about two or three hours now. Yeah, how lovely. What a really nice perk for sure. I still can't believe how fast that first flight went. It was unbelievable. Here are the showers, but they're all occupied at the moment. Okay, so here's what the shower looked like. I've literally just got in and got out very quick and I've changed in my leggings and a top, but they didn't have any towels, so I had to use a bath mat. I don't know if they've replenished them since. Yeah, that's a bigger towel. That's a proper big towel. Okay, well, there's one there now, but there wasn't a minute ago. <laughs> oh, wow. This is way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. We're just trying to figure out where we go. They have got complete mix, to be honest. Everything you would expect for breakfast time. Should we have a look in some of these? Basically like a full English style. I already had some fruit and yogurt, didn't I? So I don't really want more of that. I am gonna grab a bottle of water though. or we'll ask them to fill up my water bottle. We've got some muffins and croissants and toast. This lounge goes all the way back down there. Okay, down this end, I found desserts, guys. I've got an ice cream cart, but that's obviously a bit early for that. But there's a whole dessert section here. So obviously we were gonna go and investigate, even though I don't want anything right now. Oh my gosh, it's like a proper patisserie sort of shop. Do you know what I mean? We've just realized that Costa is included. So I got myself an iced tea because I want a cold drink. I can't believe it's included. I just got my wallet out like, hello. I need to fill up our water bottles to be honest. Okay, we are boarding for Auckland. Getting on the next plane. Another A380, yeah. Look, Ben, so that we're on the top floor. <laughs> Okay, we're in. I've opted for an orange juice. I'm playing some music, so I'll make this quick, but it's definitely a different plane. That is cool. That is really nice. I thought we'd have a look at this menu quickly. So for lunch, we've got some starters again. I'm not sure if I want any of those. Maybe the salmon. But then they have a beef for lunch, yes. Thai red curry, yeah. I'm having the beef though, absolutely. Oh, look at breakfast, Ben. Did we get banana pancakes? Or an omelette? Are they pajamas? We didn't get pajamas on the last one. Right, are you ready? Feel them. Oh my gosh. 
We've got our pajamas. They are so soft. Even the bag is nice. They're proper Emirates pajamas. Oh. See, like a hoodie without a hood, and then some trousers. Tra 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 Pocket. This is very you. Yeah. So yeah, this is our setup for the afternoon. I've got my compression socks on. I've got my switches this time. Oh, you've pulled it out. I, I should um, go and get mine. I downloaded Tony Hawk. Oh yeah. Enjoy your flight with Emirates. Sorry, but look how many miles it is. Nearly 9,000 miles. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> the hot towel has take off and landing. Oh, it's all the little things. I've just woken up from a little 15 minute nap. I've got a smoothie. Benji's got a cosmopolitan. Living your best life, babe. Ah, oh, Life with the Water Boys still. Episode 8. subscribed already make sure you subscribe so you don't miss all the vlogs that we're going to be making from this trip because there's going to be lots treat this morning i've got banana pancakes and fruit and a little croissant this smells absolutely incredible benji's got the omelette what else have we got in there bacon, bacon mushroom mushroom salsa kind of thing i put a bit of makeup on freshened up done my teeth breakfast was lovely and i'm now gonna play on my switch for a bit for an hour or so disney dreamlight valley i've been reading on my kindle too it's just been really lovely. We both had another little sleep. It's gone so fast. I do have quite prominent eye bags here, but I'm feeling good and ready to get to New Zealand. This is my very first time visiting. It looks so beautiful with all the sea. I'm so excited. We have arrived. Look at this for an entrance. How cool is that? Wow. This airport feels so new, doesn't it? We are at baggage claim. Benji's gone to try and get the cases. He's got a trolley. We found that worked pretty well when we were in Heathrow. And then we have a transfer booked because of our Emirates business flight. They booked us a tra onward transfer, which is absolutely wild. Success, all four cases arrived. I love this custom, uh, customs agent as well. Yeah, she was so nice. She was like, where are you wearing the dress? <laughs> Yay, wow, we made it. Why do I feel really emotional? So oh my gosh. The weather's so I love looking at the window and just soaking it all up, looking at the views, looking at the different restaurants and shops and it's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And on first impressions everything's very clean. So happy to be here. <laughs> 
we're staying at the Grand by Sky City. So we will show you this more in the next vlog. And just like that, we are here. We're safe, we're in our hotel room and we're gonna save showing you it for the next vlog. So watch the next one. Make sure you subscribe. We were just saying in the car that that was such an amazing flight. The yeah. whole experience was incredible. The cabin crew, the quality of the food, the amazing seats, the lounges. It felt so easy. I feel fresh now to go and bop around. I don't need a nap. I don't need anything. I'm, I'm fresh and good. ready to go. <laughs> it's like we've beaten some jet lag or at least tried. Don't <laughs> don't keep me to that in like an hour's time if I'm we'll flying, but right now I'm fine. We're doing good, but yeah, it was amazing. So real bucket list experience for us both to mm. be able to do it and such an amazing way to travel for so long. I didn't feel claustrophobic or I wanted to get off and it was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be actually in terms of the timing. I and because like we, we were both sat in the middle as well, we didn't have to like worry about anyone else like spilling your elbows over yeah. or like you, you can have your own little area yeah. and you can have your laptop out or your iPad it out It was so quiet and it was just so nice. Everything about it was perfect. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed coming along with us. We're now going to get settled here in Auckland for the next six days and then we'll be getting on the ship on Friday. So today's Sunday. So we're going to do a separate vlog of Auckland. So New Zealand part one and then we're on the ship doing a bit of New Zealand as we sale too but for now thank you for watching this one we'll see you again in the next one see you later bye, bye.